Uh, my name is George Quit. I'm an artist from Sydney at uh, UNSW Art and Design. I've been invited here by the curator Catherine Wilkinson and David Doyle, the director. Um, and this is the inaugural exhibition in this beautiful new gallery space at Dada Fremantle. The work I do um, for the past really nearly 18 years now has all been using biosensors and these are interactive experiences where people explore kind of thresholds and um, different states inside their bodies. I work a lot with nervous system responses, the stress relaxation responses and also more recently I've been working with uh, brain waves. Um, so there are two works in this exhibition. The first work um, that I'm here with now is called Metamatics and um, that's visualising and sonifying changes in heart rate um, that you can influence with your breathing and your emotional state. It's a very slow, slightly challenging interaction and it takes about two minutes to collect that data. Um, but uh, the beautiful thing, the way we've extolled it in this show here, is we, you get to see two people interacting at once and you can compare and contrast the different um, patterns generated by people. Um, they're listening to a, it's almost like a guided meditation, um, helping people connect into their body, land a bit inside their bodies. And then there's an invitation to explore feelings of compassion and kindness, see how that influences the pattern in the heart visualisation and sounds. And then if they want to, they can imagine something stressful or negative or neutral um, and see if that eventually um, influences the appearance and sound of the work. The second work in this exhibition is called Behind Your Eyes, Between Your Ears. And that's a brainwave controlled work measuring alpha waves. Alpha waves are usually really low when we're thinking and with our eyes awake, but when we close our eyes, they seem to go up a lot. I think that's to do with the reduction in mental stimulation. And the interesting thing is when we quieten our mind and stop thinking so much and be more in the quality of being, they seem to go up a whole lot more. So I use uh, the values we can measure in the sensor <coughs> and I use those changes in value to mix sounds and to mix visual patterns. So um, people literally control noise in the room, crackling noises, by making the noise in the mind go away. Uh, and then once they can stay quiet, they can reveal uh, different layers of sound and visuals. Ironically, in that work, you have to interact with it with your eyes closed. But I've designed an experience where these people are inside a booth and other visitors to the gallery can observe that interaction um, through what we call a Pepper's Ghost illusion. So they're seeing these people as if they're immersed in this sea of light. Um, and they're shifting from kind of fiery colours to cool, watery colours based on this quality of um, mental stillness. So it's been a wonderful opportunity connecting with um, Dada's audiences and members and the artists who come here um, to do their own work, um, giving them an experience of these technologies and this way of making art. It's quite different from some of the more traditional methods um, we use. And uh, the response so far has been really good and really positive. And uh, people have been really touched by this very different way of experiencing body and, and experiencing art as well.